I love everything Harry Potter, but I thought $4.79 for a mug was too much to pay for either home decor or resale. My husband went shopping to the local Goodwill during his lunch break uh, to relieve a little bit of stress and see what he could find. My husband knows that I love transferware and oh my goodness, look at this huge platter. And oh my goodness, it is huge. Um, it's made by Churchill and it is in perfect condition. And he surprised me when he with it when he got home. Please stay tuned till the end of the video where I show you the everything that we brought home. This is so deceiving. <laughs> it fooled me because those goblets, the the thing, the blue thing with the hole in the center and that tray are all, I thought they were all ceramic and they're all plastic. So these were kind of cute, except that they're not the thick hand-blown Mexican glasses that you normally see um, or occasionally see. These were very lightweight. Um, this, however, is a blue agate and my husband um, FaceTimed me. Uh, when he was there and asked me if he should get that and I said yes, absolutely. I love agate I put it on eBay and it sold immediately Once he got off work, we decided to go to one of our favorite Salvation Armies and see what we could find there. This is one of the smallest stores that I've come across and almost every time we go there we find at least one really awesome thing. Uh, I, and usually way more than that. It's so fun going to this store. So make sure that you always check the boxes. I have found awesome things at this store in the boxes. And these, these were so awesome. These are such great um, cups. They're Snoopy cups. And of course we had to get them. And what's really funny is that we have had three things that we have found that are Snoopy related. Um, items and they were all totally different items and they all have sold uh, really quickly it's the funniest thing other people love snoopy too I thought these frosted glasses were really interesting. I thought they were really pretty and they could possibly be uh, vintage. And so what I did is I opened up the eBay app on my phone and what you do is you take a picture 
of the item and then that will bring up all the current uh, comparables, all the current items that are selling that are the same thing. And then you go to the filter and you push on the sold items and that'll give you all the recent solds for that item. Oh my goodness, we saw these cups. They're milk glass, and two of them have that twall pattern, and in blue, by the way, and then this really um, 70s, 60s uh, flower power thing going on. So, of course, we got those. And then look at this. Look at this. It's so beautiful. It's a fox mug with a, a lid with a little fox on top. Oh my goodness, I was in love with this thing, and of course I bought it. And it's part of my home decor, of course. I saw this beautiful mug, and it's a Rington's mug, uh, or cup. And it's just beautiful, look at that. And it's called Best Friends Look, it's so cute. So when we come to the store, we always start at the mug section because inevitably we always find at least one charming mug. And look at this one. Oh my goodness, it's so cute. It's all Christmas cats.
Oh my goodness, look at this gorgeous blue and white transferware plate. That for sure came home with me. And did you notice the, the plates of the queen and the queen mother? They were so pretty, but they're commemorative plates. I, I just, what was I gonna do with those? This is the inside part of a butter bell and my husband was trying to see if he could find the other part for it. But we didn't have any luck. Before I started doing this, I didn't even know that garlic keepers existed, and now I see them everywhere. I was looking at this because I'm always on the hunt for uh, Christmas decor, it doesn't matter what time of the year, and uh, I just 
if it's beautiful, I, I pick it up. But I think that there was just something about this that was a little thick, clunky. I don't know. There was something about it I, I didn't quite like. I'm kind of regretting not getting this pan of gingerbread men. Um, somebody on, on YouTube showed that they use them as decor in their kitchen. And I thought that was a cute idea. I should have, I don't know, should I have picked that up and used it as decor in my kitchen? I'm not sure. It looked kind of big. These little wooden people were so cute. You could use them for Thanksgiving decor. One of the last times we were at the store, we found some um, Vaseline glass votive holders, and we also found some beautiful cut crystal um, globes for the ceiling fan lights. And it, now we're, we're just looking to see if we see anything else. I remember I also found a Jim Shore brand new in the box. Um, at this store as well uh, at the bottom shelf there so uh, we're always looking to see if we see anything that nobody else has noticed or something just it, that's wonderful uh, just sitting there but this time around um, we didn't quite notice anything and this is a fake Wedgwood people
I thought these birds were absolutely adorable. They, um, I, we found out that they are Chinese made, but look how cute they are. We see so many snow globes that um, are just sitting there with their water all changed in color and they've lost water and I think it's because we live in Central California and it gets hot here during the summer and I think that those uh, that people leave snow globes sitting too close to their windows maybe um, and that's what's damaging them. But yeah, once they get to that point, there's no going back. Oh my goodness, this was so well done. Um, I, I had to get it. It was just so well done and so charming. So we got some fun items um, over at Salvation Army and then um, my husband did <laughs> an afternoon lunch break um, trip to Goodwill. So he found a couple of items. Um, this was really interesting to me. It was so cute and so well made um, that it, it just looks 3D in so many different ways. Um, it's done so well and I didn't know anything about it. It's, it's on a little piece of wood and um, it was $3.99 and I looked this up and it's by a famous artist. Um, I can't remember her name right now. I'll, I'll put it up above for you. Um, and she does so many of these type of, of uh, like 3D images of, of famous places. Um, and I just thought this was really cute. So um, I had to get it, <laughs> I just had to. And then I also found these, which were so, so much fun. And uh, when we looked them up, they, we found that they um, sell for good money. Um, I love Snoopy. I always have. And it, it just is so much fun to have these. These are really big glasses. I don't know what they're for. Um, one of them uh, has a little critter in there. Uh, thankfully, it's dead. Um, but um, anyway, it... And this is, look how fun, these superstars stay in shape. Uh, and the other one says, I mean look how fun, this is so cute. And then uh, it says, 
nothing's as easy as it looks. And isn't that the truth? Um, so, and these were originally um, done in, I guess, 1958, but I think these were made in uh, 1980s, I believe. Um, but anyway, so much fun. They're so cute. Look at that. I love Snoopy. So much fun. Um, yeah, so, so much fun. So cute. Um, so we got those. Oh, and we paid $1.99 each. And then we saw these sitting on, on the, um, on the shelves. And we, I, I just love Twall. And, um, and then this one just looks so groovy, doesn't it? <laughs> it looks so fun. It's milk glass. And they're little milk glass um, cups, I guess. They're very thin and uh, petite, and, and they're just so cute. Um, but this one is so from the 60s, isn't it? Just so much fun. Um, and then this, these are so pretty. Look at, look at, so pretty. These are so pretty. So we got two of these, and these also were $1.99 a piece. And then we saw this, which, oh my goodness, I just fell in love with. Um, it's a fox, look how cute. And look how cute this is for um, the fall. And it's got a little fox. Um, look tea cup coat cover and look at the handle it's so fun it, it, it's just so cute um paid 3.99 for it and it has absolutely no damage it is perfectly intact look at how pretty and it's on both sides it's so cute um but yeah perfectly intact and um just Adorable, adorable. Um, when I was born, um, my my father's friends would call him uh, the fox, I guess because of his pointy nose. And um, when when I came along, they would call me a little fox. So I don't know what that was about, but I've just always loved that story and and. Um, that I, I love foxes too. So anyway, um, had that. And oh, by the way, one Christmas, we woke up and it was Christmas day and there was a fox sitting, laying outside in my backyard. It was the coolest thing. And he l stayed with us pretty much the whole day. It, it was so cool. Um, and then he just jumped the fence and took off. Uh, we didn't even realize it, but so cute. He came to hang out with us that day. Okay, so this was really fun. I don't know um, how old it is, but look at the back. You see that? It's so cool. Now, I don't know if it was originally done in the 19, or in the 1800s, 1832 it says. Um, and here's the stamp, it's impressed. Uh, I don't know, this is so cool. Um, we got it for $2, it, it does have a, a little bit of a, a ding, and it looks like somebody tried to repair it not well so I don't know how much that depreciates it um, at least I think it was yeah it looks like somebody tried to repair it poorly um, but we, we just couldn't leave it behind this was just such a fun find um, it's the blue willow pattern obviously but 
made in England and I don't know what year it was made in England. So, 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 so much fun. Um, and then moving on, um, found this. Again, made in England and look how cute. I love cats, I love cats. Um, we had two cats for um, 20 and one, 20 and 22 years respectively. Um, they, they just kind of stayed with us and passed away shortly one after the other. It was heartbreaking. So we haven't gotten any others. Um, it was fairly recent. So anyway, um, have this and it is so much fun. It's new. It's brand new. Um, it still even has its original sticker. Uh, I'm not quite sure who makes it, um, but it's really fun. Look at those kitties. It's so much fun. Um, I tried lifting up the sticker. I, I, I don't even remember if I actually found out who it was or not. Paid two dollars for it. And, oh, hey, um, Spectrum Designs. Okay, and it's just so much fun. There's no damage to it, and um, it's brand new, brand new, and really cool. I love those kitties. And look at how fun the handle is. So cool. And then, oh my goodness, we found another Otagiri. <laughs> um, we just are finding them everywhere now. Uh, I love these. They are so well made. Um, and just really a lot of fun. We paid $1.99 for that one. And then finally I found this. And number one is my baby loves flamingos. Um, he's six now and he loves his flamingos. And these are from Ever Everglades National Park. And I thought that this would be so much fun to hang from his stocking for Christmas. Um, so, yeah, he's he's getting this, ah, if I don't break it. But so cute. And um, here's the tag for it. So, really fun. Um, yeah. So that was fun, we got them for $2. And then my husband went on a shopping trip and he found this enormous Blue Willow platter and paid $4.79 for it. Um, it appears that that was their, their price of the day. Um, everything was priced at $4.79. Uh, it is Churchill and it is heavy. And it's a nice platter, and there's nothing wrong with it, nothing at all. So, um, really excited to get this um, because I can also use it. This is so beautiful. And then he also got this, if I can reach it. It's so beautiful. Look at that. Some quartz and it's in blue and I love it. And it has this felt bottom, um, again, $4.79, but um, really fun stuff. And so he, these were the only items he found um, that he wanted to bring home. And um, yeah, they're really fun. He called me and kind of FaceTimed me and said, what do you think of this? Yeah, I love it. Bring it home. So anyway, look at how beautiful it is. I just love quartz. Um, and look at that. So beautiful. I love it. And it's it's thick and uh, that's just gonna be such a fun design piece just to have laying around. It's so beautiful. Um, and that was our shopping trip. That was, uh, those were the items that we got. And I think we got some really, fun stuff, and I hope you enjoyed. Thanks so much.
If you liked this video, please click on this one next.